Perhaps this is interesting to tell as a kind of vlog. I had to replace uh, the fan blower resistor of my car and that's a Kia. A Kia Picanto. I bought it a few days ago. And well, this is that um, resistor, the fan blower resistor. You can see it here. And you can also see that the contacts are completely corroded. I think there was water leaking inside the box where this um, um, resistor, fan blower resistor, was mounted anyway. I think it's an interesting way how they made in Korea uh, this resistor anyway. First, perhaps interesting to tell, here is how it was made. The air inlet, the blower, the blower uh, sends its uh, air into the, into the car via the air output. This is the air input. And there's a good thing, that was a good idea, uh, the blower also cools the resistor. And you can see it here, this here, by the way, this is my uh, soldering connection, not relevant, but uh, this is relevant. You can see here the cooling plate of that resistor, and it's mounted here with a very thin layer of isolation material, looks like mica. At least we call that in the Netherlands Mika. Uh, I don't know the, the right word in English or American or whatever. Um, and it goes here in between and then the cooling plate is on top of that. So that there is heat developed here. Um, transported via that uh, isolation material into the heat sink. And that's a thing that we often see also in classical electronic circuits. And uh, when you study the theory about that, uh, we are talking about the heat transmission via such a uh, isolation material. Could also be silicone and then into the, the real heat sink where that resistor has to dissipate its heat. And of course, 12 volt uh, on 12 volt systems, such a resistor can get extremely hot, and that's uh, of course the reason why they mounted it here inside that air box. So cool air in, blowing through the um, through the, the box to the air outlet, etc. In general, such a circuit works in this way. Of course, this completely classical, old school um, technology. Here is the positive of 12 volts. Here is a resistor. <coughs> that resistor, resistor is in series with the motor. And because the motor also has to induce a, a kind of fierce uh, air current that motor will surely, surely take up a lot of amperes, say one ampere, perhaps five ampere in the maximum um, range, etc. So, uh, the resistor develops heat, uh, say the voltage drops here, and I made an earlier video where, where you could see how that works and how much heat can be developed in such a resistor. Well, that's more or less all to tell. And here, let's look again at this, this, the beautiful way that this was made. We see here a kind of, say, resistance layer. And I think it is made of a, a special material that has a certain resistance. Uh, as far as I can, can see, it's, it looks at as if it is damped up, that layer. 
and there are certain contacts and uh, perhaps I have to lift up this upper layer to see to watch uh, to the other contacts that are perhaps under this layer so perhaps there is a, a two layer situation of uh, such a resistor I don't know that for sure but I have to uh, break it open and I don't want that at the moment I only wanted to show the same kind of principles here are by the way the um, the measurements for a properly working resistor of course I bought a new one uh, I can uh, advise no one to repair such a uh, fan blower uh, resistor it's very cheap approximately 15 euros perhaps 15 dollars I don't know that anyway uh, it's not worse to repair it but these are the healthy values in terms of resistance that you can measure when the uh, unit is put in this position so with that kind of lock to the upper side these are the ohms values that I measure for a healthy resistor 0 0.8 ohms between these two pins 0 0.1 between these two 0 0.5 between these two and 1 ohm approximately between these two pins and here kind of cross also ohms um, values and I have to say that I only measured it with this meter that's surely not a precise meter um, in the low ohms region so you have to look very very closely to what happens here when you do these measurements but I only want to give an indication perhaps it's interesting for other people that uh, encounter this kind of problem so again uh, replace it and well I hope it was a little bit interesting how this works and thanks for watching